I forgot to put on my glasses so I can see. Comments. Comments, questions, concerns. Hello, Yornick. How are you? Hello, Gamecock. Chip, howdy. Subbing for Simon. Hello, Patrick. Patrick says hello, Stumbo family. Here, I'll turn you around, Patrick. They can tell you hi. There you go. Hi. Whoa. <laughs> Zeus, you gonna say hi? You gonna say hi? <laughs> Zeus, you gonna say hi? You Max? You Max gonna say hi? <laughs> hello, Bob. How's Bob tonight? Hello, Randy. Hello, Jeannie. How are you all? How was your all's week? Everybody have a good week, I hope. Good, Bob. Good. Hello, Jeff. Jeff said hello. Y'all want to say hi to Jeff? I'll flip you back around. <laughs> hi. <laughs> Zeus shook his head no. <laughs> Good. Just got back from visiting family in New Jersey. How far is that drive for you all? Is that a, is that a pretty far drive, Jeannie, New Jersey? Didn't do nothing at all day and yet tired. Sometimes that happens, Jordan. Doesn't that always seem to be the case? Hello, Jack. How's Jack doing this weekend? Three hour one way. So a six hour drive. You must like that part of the family. That's a lot of driving to see them. Is that cousins or is that like immediate family? Have you eaten any yet, Jeff? My mom, dad, and sister. Yeah, so it's immediate family. Not like cousins or anything. That's good. That's good. I see you've been making some more pops, Jack. I seen that, and then I watched. Uh, I watched Jay Mouton, the ten minute uh, corn cob modification. That was pretty cool. If y'all haven't seen it, yeah, I seen you been busy. I seen that, Jack. Just got in out of the mailbox. Oh, 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 really? Fix you a piece of toast. Try it out. Let me know how it is. Let me know what you think, Jeff. Try it. Hurry up. Try it out. If I wanted to visit my in-laws, I suspect it might take me a day or two. Not to mention crossing a lot of borders. Do they live far away from you, Yornick? You're talking about borders. You're talking about going to countries. Hello. Gamecock says he's smoking wings. Wings.
another continent. Wow. Yeah, that's quite a long ways. I probably wouldn't cross state lines, let alone countries, and definitely not continents. As y'all see in the title, I'm subbing for Simon. This is a busy religious weekend, not just for Simon, but for a lot of people. You have Easter, Passover, Ramadan. So you have a lot of uh, religious things going on this weekend. Uh, I know Simon had Sabbath yesterday, and then he has uh, Passover. And I think he said he had festival on the last two days. I ate a spoonful of it. <laughs> You can put it on uh, ice cream. Some people do. Uh, we've always put it on uh, like cathead biscuits and stuff is the way we've eat it, Jeff. Uh, keep it in the freezer. Keep it stored in the freezer. Like if you're going to have toast or a biscuit or, or something like that, just get it out before you fix the toast. Get it out. Just let it sit down. And then once you fix the toast, two or three minutes, it's a, it's it's... It's like ice cream, it, you know, a couple minutes and it's a, you can scoop it out. What's going on in Kentucky today? Nothing. Hello, Robert. Oh, yeah, we've been spraying. Well, we've, we, we're trying, we have a problem here with finding somebody to cut grass. Did I say hello, Robert? Hello, Robert. Anyway, hi, Steve. Uh... Yeah, vanilla ice cream, yeah, you can put it on any, but ice cream is really good. Actually, I need to send Tony some. Write that down. I thought I did. Did we send Tony some? I don't know. Did we send Tony? Because I meant to send Tony because I wanted him to try. He let us try. No, he let us try uh, the, uh, the, 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 oh, what's it called? For, not for pizza sauce, marinara but sauce. marinara sauce. Thank you. Well, what did I and I wanted to send Tony a, a thing to do it. I don't know what I sent Tony. Oh, I sent him. I sent Tony uh, some cigars. Oh. That's what it is. Okay. Jam was real good. Yeah, jam and jelly is real good. This is uh, this is preserves. Preserves is a little different. Just a tad. Just a little different. All three of them's kind of close. But uh, hello, Simon. Hello, Phil. Yeah. Oh, Simon's the. Yeah. Yeah, I was talk I was telling everybody just a few minutes ago, Phil, about it being uh Simon's well, it's I said it was religious for a lot of Christianity, like a lot. It's 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 Easter, it's it's Passover, it's it's Ramadan, so uh and then during this time of year I always think to the Dome of the Rock because the Dome of the Rock, uh in Jerusalem, I mean you have Christianity, you have Islam, you have Muslims, you have the Jewish faith, you, you have so many. I mean, it, uh, you know, some people believe that's where Muhammad ascended to heaven. And Solomon, I mean, uh, 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 Solomon's Mount, uh, Solomon's Temple. Uh, uh, I mean, it's, it's, there, there's a lot going on, especially over there. I would, I, that, I, I, I sit and I think about how hard it is probably for them to keep the peace uh, because everybody wants a piece of that specific spot. So I just hope yet again that religion don't cause deaths. But yeah, he's off. Oh, I finally got my tea back. First time I've had any of my tea in over six weeks or something. They haven't had any here, have they? It was longer than that, I think. Was well, it longer than that? Probably two months, Kim said. I haven't had any in a while. You just can't find it here. 
And then finally she found it. Yes, she found some and then went to another store. You said you found three cases? Three yesterday, three today. Three cases. So she bought me three cases. And Phil coming in with the religion don't cause it. Beliefs cause it. Dag on it. Beliefs. I'm not going to argue with you, Phil. That's fine. I'll get you over here. Don't worry about it, Jim. Back in the 70s and 80s, I grew strawberries. I had 85,000 plants. I still have That's a lot of plants. I never grew 85,000 of anything. No, I was sitting here smoking Penzance. But I have it out. I, well, no, not the red eye. I, I, you asked for red eye. But I, I do have one of the 8C. Uh, and without taking my glasses off, I believe that stands for Havana uh, Connections or something like that. Havana Collection. Havana Collection. Uh, and then the bottom little bitty sticker says... Habana, Colorado. Habana, Colorado, and Habana Collections. But no, I haven't smoked it yet. I, I did get one out just in case I finished this Benzance. I wasn't, I <laughs> feel I'm just joking, man. <laughs> it's because I raised my voice, though, man, I'm yelling. It's just, I'm just, I'm just, just aggravating you, feel. Just smile and laugh, brother. Smile and laugh. That's all I want from you. Smile and laugh. I'm just, I'm, <laughs> I supplied restaurants and eight farm stands. With 85,000 strawberries, Bob, I'd say you supplied a lot. I could supply all of Kentucky with 85,000 plants. I could probably supply all of every state. Uh, not all the states together, but every state, just... From my understanding, they are made by XI. That's going together on me. What? I can't. XIKAR. XIKAR is that what it says? I, think so. I can't see. XIKAR. XIK. What? Zyker. 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 I don't. I'm ignorant on that name. I'm grinning. Good. Smile for you. Hello, Glum Chum. How's Matt doing? You doing all right, brother? Well, I like to pick on Phil. Yeah, I like joking with Phil. Phil gets, Phil gets tore up. Hello, Bar Wolf and Miss Kathy. How are you two lovely folks doing this season? Cause we care. Yeah, I got, I got nothing but love for Phil. Got nothing but love for everybody. Yeah, hello, Matt. There's Tony. Yeah. I'm unpickable. Hi, Matt. Hi, hey, Randy. Zycar. Zycar. Thank you, Jeff. Did you hear him? Zycar. Z-I-C-A-R. Zycar. Is how it's pronounced. Uh, Zycar. So this, he thinks this is made by Zycar, which I'm not sure. I, I, I can't. I can't. See, that's my problem. I just smoke them. I have to show up somebody else. It's me. Uh, what is that? Corojo. I got to roll my R's again. Corojo. 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 I got to make my tongue. Corojo. Corojo. El Corojo. El Corojo. I gotta hold my head up to do it. El Corojo. El Corojo. It says right there, El Corojo. El Corojo. It says right there on it. But I, I don't see no Zycar, Jeff. I don't know nothing about it. You know more about it than I do, brother. I, I will be... I'm not going to act like I'm... Some people can sit and talk about everything, and, and I, I don't know. They know a lot. I'm ignorant about uh, a 
few things and don't care if I tell you I'm ignorant. Don't mean I'm stupid. Just means I don't know about that subject. Hello, said. We're doing good. 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 Have you been working a lot? Has is, is, is Miss Kathy been working any? I know she still gets called in from time to time. Really? What kind of cigar cutter do you use, Jeff? Do you use the straight or, or what kind do you use? I should have asked you that a year ago, before and now. Do you know my problem with cigar cutters? Do you just keep buying like those $30 ones? Or, or, or what do you do? Uh, Yornick says, according to her parents, my lady started to row her R's after living in Russia for a while. I would say so. Corojo. There you go. Right off the bat. How about just biting off? You can do that, JD, but the problem is, is you push it all together. You can push it together sometimes and it cuts the air flow off. That's the problem that I have with some, uh, some of my cigar cutters is it, it, it crimps it together instead of cutting it because they get dull. Steph and Skip, well, I don't know Skip, sir. Just, I'll just, hi, Steph. How are you doing? That's all I've ever done. I, yeah, I did that growing up. I mean, that's what we did growing up. That's what. That's hundred percent what we did growing up. But I mean, I understand it cutting. She will work some next week, but isn't okay. So she hasn't had any shifts for a while. The uh, Bob says, depending on the cigar, I have a punch, V cutter, and straight. See, I, all I have is the straight cutter, or the guillotine. I guess you'd call it. I don't have a punch or a V cutter, and I wouldn't know which ones to use it. I use the Cuban Crafters. Bought it off of Amazon for twenty dollars a few years. Cuban Crafters, will you write that down? Cuban, I'm writing it on. The yeah. Place, so don't thank them for being here. Uh, says it stays sharp. Jeff says it stays sharp. If if I could get one that stays sharp, that would be that would be wonderful. I have two that I spent like thirty dollars on. Then I got that one for free. That cheap and, and and it works the best. It's got a back on it, but the others are just you can see it push the cigar like over halfway down to cut it before it cuts it. It's kind of like a dull bread knife. You know how you push the bread down? Well, I don't know. I don't. I don't know if you've ever made any homemade bread, but we make homemade bread here, and and you can take some knives and they'll push the bread and squash it flat before a bread knife shouldn't do that. You, you know, you need it big enough to put a piece of meat and a tomato on it. Uh, you know, so you can't be squashing the bread. Uh, he's here. We are good. About to watch The Godfather. Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Wednesday. Y'all have fun watching The Godfather, Steph. Thank you very much for stopping by. Uh, Col Col Colibri? Is that what that says? I can't... The letter, is that C-O-L-L-B-R-I or C-O... C-O-L-I-B-R-I. I need to get me something better to see. Well, I, I can't. My, my, my eyes. Well, I would still be saying the same, right? Colibri makes a cutter. It's both a straight and a V cutter. Hello, picking and... Hello, picking and popping. Bell said, Bell said, mess that up. <laughs> It cuts, yes, that's all I want it to do. Just cut the top of the cap. That's what I want. That other one with the back does that. It just cuts a little bit. Sometimes I will admit I go a little too far in cutting too much. My cigar lighter has a built-in punch. I, I, the only th I have, where, can y'all give me the, uh, I'll show you what I use for, where's the garbage lighter? That's my cigar lighter, but. While they're getting that, did you get some? Did I say, no, hi, Sharon. I did not see Sharon. Kim said Sharon. I hope you are okay, Sharon. Are you okay, Sharon? Sharon, I'm sorry, please. I apologize. Please say something else. I did not see it. I was talking. I should have shut up, Sharon. Here, who makes this, Amber? Who makes that? What does it say? What does it say? No wonder I got it upside down. 
What does that say anyway? Read that. Vertigo? Is that what it is? Vertigo? I might be saying it wrong. I don't know. That's Can't even see. Like. Yeah, vertigo. That's correct. No, you're right. There's what I use to light, but I call it, the kids call it, it's, the kids call it, that's what they use for the garbage. It's a three, three torch light. The kids use it for the garbage outside. That's what I light my lighter, or my cigars with. But the kids keep it over there in the basket to light. What, what, Kim? Um, Everett Young is here. Everett Young, hello, Everett. And Edwin Pipes, cigars. And Edwin Pipes, hello, Edwin. I didn't see that. I was trying to uh, current, uh, da, 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 take take a 30 caliber casting, sharpen edge, and use as a plug cutter. Take a 30 caliber. I, I do have a 30 caliber. Uh, I tell you what I used to use it on was to make eyes when I was doing something. And I always used a 30 out six uh, casing to make eyes. Uh, it makes perfect eyes, like if you're doing like a little carving, like in clay and stuff, and you're making like eyes, it makes perfect for like, uh, for like, for like eyeballs. Those are good lighters. That's, that's what I use, Bob. If you're talking about the thing, great ideal feel. That's a great lighter. Yeah, that's, that's what I use. I have like, I don't know, I have three or four of them, and I put one in Kim's car, and and Amber's car for a lighter, and, and I've got like two in the house. And the other day, when I was trying to show you how, oh, they couldn't find a one of them. They had them all gone. How's Edwin doing? I didn't say, who else did you say come in? How's Edwin? I've seen uh, some of your... Some of your, uh, uh, I, I see your things on IG. Who else come in, you said? Everett and Edwin. Everett. How you doing, Everett? How you doing, sir? I hope you're all right. Yes. I lay my cutter on a table and put the end of the cigar down in it, and it makes it smooth. Yes short without cutting too much. Yeah, that's my problem. It's just sometimes uh, on my own, if I'm not really paying attention, like I'm just, oh, I have to take off my glasses is what I'm saying. Like if I don't take off my glasses and actually take time, then I'm just saying if I just grab one and, and I'm just walking outside or something, I'll leave my glasses on, stick it in there and cut, and sometimes I cut too much is what I'm saying. I use the tip of my knife and carve a circle. Oh, in your cigar, Edwin? That's what, I, I, I take it, that's what you're talking about. It's like a punch cutter. Everett says, I am okay, good. What did you want to change your name to? See, I was watching you the other day and I was talking to you and you must have forgot. And I was like, when you said you wanted to change your name, what did you want to change it to, Everett? Or why? Hello, everyone who I haven't said hey to. Hey, Robert. Hello. And hi to Karen, too, Robert. Yeah, on the cigar, like a punch card. Yep, yep, that's what I was taking it as. And I don't smoke cigars. Burley King, <laughs> because oh, because he was talking about the Burley. I didn't see. I didn't. I, I didn't. I didn't hear the. Because I was watching Donald, I got over there after I guessed that. And then I just, I just come in, and your comment was, "I got to change my name." Oh, here, it's Circle. Circle. Thank you. Now I'm probably going to be behind. I don't know. Zeus hit the... I haven't seen another comment. 
after average. No, leave it. No, don't hit circle. Just wait, baby. Why? Is this, huh? Uh, after ever, I'm okay. Yes, Dad. Hey, everyone knows. No, okay. There's, there's Phil. Free Burley. Free Burley King Paper Crowns for everyone. So since there's only 11 people here, so uh, can I have your phone, Kim? Yeah. Yes, thank you. Let me put my, oh! Make sure I got a hold of it first. Sorry. Yeah, I no, dropped it. Uh, you do break my phone? Huh? No, I didn't break Sorry. it. It's not broke, it's not cracked. It's not broke, it's not cracked. Hell, I gotta, where's your messages at? I used to think people holding that way out there looks dumb. Here. Now Here. I gotta do it. What kind of messages, text messages? Yeah, I got it. Okay. I saved it on my phone. Uh, I see 13 peeps. Oh, you see 13? Yeah, chill poops. Uh, so anyway, look, you are, you, uh, you all are, Awesome to me. Yeah. Like, y'all are great to me. Yeah, time I got it. Yeah, 13, 15, that's uh, time it's low. Um, y'all great to me. Y'all are really good to me. And I told Jeff that I wanted to give back to you all. Uh, I know I give a lot, I know I give a lot away, but me giving not only, it, it doesn't just let you all have stuff, it helps me. Like, it helps me when I give. It it help, it helps me with, uh, yeah. my lighter is a four jet Lotus, my V cutter is a Lotus, and my straight cutter is a uh, Zycar. Uh, I haven't heard of Lotus. Yeah, well, I guess I have a car, a flower, but not a lighter uh, or a V cutter. Are those good? I, I take they are, Bob, because you know you seem to have a lot of nice things. I don't know. But anyway, I like giving. I like giving. I like doing things like that. Uh, it helps me. So anyway, here's what I did. Since we have a low amount, I'll tell you all the time we got a low amount, that way a bunch of people don't come in. Just our regulars this year. So what I did, I ordered a bunch of stuff from Smoking Pops. I ordered a little over $100 worth just to give away on Tuesdays. Uh, I ordered a 3.5 ounce tin of McBaron plum cake. I ordered a seven ounce tin of Sir Walter Riley. I ordered a, uh, uh, a tin of McBaron HH Pure Virginia. I'm just reading my details. Let me see the other one. I ordered a tin of eight state Burley. I ordered eight ounces of Cornell and Deal's Haunted Bookshop. And I ordered three uh, Maduro Padrones. So I can give three, three Padrones away, three cigars, three Padrones. So I ordered all that just to give away. So uh, you can tell it's a good tree, bites fruit, same with people. That's, I, I, yeah. I use a Corona, oh boy. Yeah, I, yeah, I, I'm not, yeah, that's a lighter. I, I've seen a lot, a lot of people like them, and I've seen some things other about them. Oh, I used to take Burley. So, yeah, good. I don't like Burley. I'm not a Burley person, but ever who wants one of those, then they can get in on it uh, on Tuesdays. When I get it in, which it should be here before this Tuesday, 
So maybe we can maybe we can start doing that. Well, I'm thinking uh, I didn't see. What did Steve and Miss Kathy say? Wishing everybody happy Easter. Oh, happy Easter to you too, Steve and Miss Kathy. It was it was scrolling up too fast. I've heard about that. You stay on my list to try. Well, I've got some coming, Patrick. Maybe you can win it. If not, I'll see if I can't get you a ten, Patrick. If you don't win it, I'll I'll try to get you a ten. Uh, time for me to light up some haunted bookshop. Yeah, I'm not a haunted bookshop person either. I know Kane Rod loves it. Maybe you could tell him, Everett. Or, or don't even tell him. Just keep it and win it for yourself. Don't even tell him. Don't even tell him. Do you need to replace your smoke alarm? Is that what's beeping? Yeah. What's beep? Is there something beeping? I found my lighters to be hit or miss. My 70s down here. Never fails, though. You got good ears, Randy, if you can hear one of my smoke alarms. I'm trying to be, I'm going to be quiet for a minute. Is that, what was that? Is that, that noise? That, that's not the smoke alarm, though. Yo, well, sometimes when I suck into this, it has a whistle. So I'm not going to suck for, I'm, I'm going to set it down. Maybe that's what he's hearing. Right there. That, what was that? that was a smoke alarm. That's been going on for days. That ain't been going on for days. I haven't heard it. Haven't heard it. Like it's I, been really? Happening since yesterday. Uh, why didn't you tell us? Why didn't you tell us? Well, I thought I was going crazy because I was the only one here. Well, I mean, you thought you was going crazy. You just think her just beeps go off? Well, yeah. No, yeah, I, I'm sure. It, will you get out? Do we have a nine volt? I don't think so. I think it takes nine volt. I, I think. I'm pretty sure it takes nine volts. At least I know it's not my pie. There it was again. Thank you, Randy. My son wasn't going to mention it because he thought he was going crazy. It's something like, if there's a ghost in the middle of the room and nobody else is talking. First thing next week. Yeah, I, I, what, I wonder what it is. Yeah, thank you, Randy. I heard it, good ears, that was good ears. Hello, boys. Hello, Nathan. How's Nathan done? Just hit it with jumper cables. Yeah, that's what I, I think they do. Give Hunter a nine vote back. That's what I'm going to do. He's going to learn how to change it. What do you mean what's a nine volt battery? It's like a triple A or double A or battery, but it's square. And it is time for you to learn. Oh, I got some things to show you. We're not, I'm not going to, Simon. Simon usually only does about an hour. We've already been 35 minutes. Sometimes it goes on for a lot longer, but like I, I, I don't want, like I don't want to be sitting here, as Simon says, and be boring to anybody. Sometimes I got a little whistle in my my pipe, but I didn't think it was that loud. Boris, you're here. I'm smoking. Uh, since I don't have a bow call lined up, which uh, Hunter can do it. 
uh, I'm smoking Penzance uh, in my Costello 4K. Let me set this down before I drop my pipe. Costello, Costello, I should call it. Costello, Costello. Yeah. Now I can unhear it. Yeah, once you hear it the first well, time, you can. Well, see if we have a battery, please. Go in there in the battery thing. It's in the utility room. Oh, are you talking about, oh, I don't know. Yeah, go in there and get the, and bring it in here. I can't pack everybody in there, but I can show you how to do it and let everybody do it. Next time, they, he's in the airfield. He's, he is, he's in the utility room. Here, I gotta unplug it. I'll show you where he's at. He is in that second, he is that room right there. Right there he comes. You bring the batteries? Go get the, okay. Let me flip this around. No, I don't know why it didn't flip. Flip, there. Hello, TPI. I didn't see you come in, sorry sir. Here, hold my pop. Please don't drop my pop. Please don't drop my pop. I got a ton of, I know y'all can't see. I got a bunch of, look here. I, I got a bunch of batteries. Oh, look here. Speaking of those, look at there. One more of those lighters in the battery box. Also got these little bitty batteries, these little flat lithium. Those go into something that I have. I don't know. Oh. Yeah, they're you what they're I do not have a. They're they're telling you what they're smoking. Oh, they're telling me what. Oh, they're telling me what I'm smoking. Well, we'll do it. We gotta do a, a hole here. It's Take us. I don't have any nine millimeter. Or I meant nine volt. Hole here. Let me go over here and let me do, do a bow call, Hunter. They're telling you what the bow call is, Hunter. Do a bow call, son. You're getting. You're, you're sloppy. You're getting sloppy. They're wanting to do a bow call, son. They thought the smoke detector was bow call. Oh, here, no, that's just a smoke detector. Here, we'll do a bow call. Get over there, hurry. Get over there so they can do a bow call, son. I hollered out, I was looking at nine volt batteries. Y'all doing it without me. Without me. Wait on me. All right, go ahead. Bow call. There you go. But I think you can do better. I think you got a little bit better in you. All right, let's do bow call. Bob is smoking uh, McBurn HH Pure Virginia on the corn cob. Uh, TPI is rechargeable, cost uh, four years. Uh, I got a box like that, never never got the battery I want. <laughs> right, Badger? The same thing. Not smoking, watching a movie. I figured you wouldn't be Smoking grump since Simon wasn't live, and it's just me. I didn't figure you'd be outside. Honey Bookshop, in his K Woody. Uh, not smoking, I smoke myself. <laughs> Silly years. Captain Black, hello, Abe. Captain Black and his LCS poker. Put nine volts in the energy hunter. Uh, Mad Fiddler Flake in a Meersham. I'm pretty, no, you ain't predictable. Meershams are good. In my 301 Peterson system P lip, smoking GLP Odyssey and a Peterson Shannon Bent Brandy, KBV Brown Flake, Snowbrer. Uh, he said hi. Okay, Honey Bookshop in the Phil Rivera. I am. Uh, who who did I miss? Zippo. Parker Bulldog with a uh, quiet nice. Zippo and Boris. Trying to figure out what vapor to smoke. H.H. Pure Virginia. I love H.H. I love H.H. Pure Virginia. Hello, Hawk. Haven't seen you in a little bit. How are you, buddy? You all right? I have an Odyssey full flavor cigar. 
And Miss Kathy has a Mirhan Brazil. Nothing wrong with smoking a cigar. I got one here myself. But I, if I if I go out real quick, if we go, I don't know how long. I didn't like plan. It's 7:40. Like I can show you all a few things. There's nothing wrong with being busy at work. I understand, Hawk. I just just know that you're missed, brother. Know that you're missed. Like the other day, Patrick wasn't here, and I was like, Patrick usually calls, you know, he usually does the five minutes to Oak Island, Oak Island and, and, you know, I didn't see that last week, and I was, you know, I was like, man, where's Patrick at? I hope he's all right, you know. He was at a meeting. Uh, he was at a pot meeting, actually. But, you know, I mean, you miss people. You miss people, Hawk. You know what I mean? Like, you miss people. Planning not to say, well, I'm just doing it for Simon, and, you know, and, and uh, uh, I really don't have like a, a thing. Like mine is two hours, but I don't, I didn't have a thing. I told the kids probably like an hour, I guess, and then everybody get tired of it, uh, you know, because I know it's midnight for you all, almost uh, one o'clock uh, across the pond. You and me both feel. I told, I, I fast forward, I don't know, two or three weeks ago. Uh, two or three weeks ago, we watched one late. There was something happened. And so I watched it late. And we, was, we, 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 we DVR it. Uh, we tape it anyway because Amber can watch it because she don't get to watch it. She's at college. She doesn't have a TV. And uh, so we tape it anyway for her. And there was something happening when we was watching through it. And I just kept fast forwarding. I fast forward through the whole thing. They didn't find nothing but, you know, 1,800 wood or whatever. And, and I was like, daggone, I got 1,800 wood here at the house. You know, I wish you would find, find something. Please. Make some tea. I love tea. That's what I'm, I love my tea. I love my tea. They do that too as well, yeah. Phil. They tell you about the the previous uh, uh, episodes and previous years. But I, but I understand the previous year stuff because if you just started watching it, or even if you have watched it, sometimes I forget about um, about you know stuff from three four years ago. I find a lot of nails that they do. But yeah, uh, you can't. You've been talking about. Uh, uh, Latakia, Boris, and 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 I've been I haven't smoked much Latakia here lately, uh, and I love Latakia. I, I don't I, I love all of it. I love Virginia to to I don't like I I, <laughs> I like basically all of it. I like Virginia. I like aromatics. I like Latakia. Uh, the only one I don't really like is Burley. And I, I just don't like the sa soap taste. Drinking black tea with lemongrass tea mixed. Well, I don't know about New Island, but you know, I don't know if you all watched or not, but they was able to go out in the bay and do, uh, put those big steel metal things that go 20 foot. If they do that and they're only wanting to go like 130 foot down, they can stick five of those metal things on top of each other and make like a dam all around that and just dig down. Just one time, one dig, dig down, get it all covered all around with those metal things and be done with it. Yeah, they have found gold on their badger. They, I mean, there's something there. 
I mean, there's something there. You just don't have, you just don't have wood at 140 feet down. Like there's somebody built a tunnel 140 feet down in the 1600s or, you know, somebody did that. And just think, they did that with a a, a, a crappy pickaxe and shovel. Like it's not as good as the shovels and pickaxe that we have today. Like they dug all that with pickaxe and shovel. And and you're telling me we can't go with with our big scoops and stuff. We can't go 140 foot and and cover that. Getting ready to brew some full moon tea. I don't, Jeannie. Is that like a real tea or is that like, like are you and like I don't know. Are you ready to get funky with with Randy or something? Is that what that means? I don't know. I don't know Jeannie well enough to know if her and Randy's. If she's like showing Randy or Bud or what, if that's like a real tea, like I don't know. Anyway, good luck, Randy. I don't know. Good luck, Randy. I hope it's awesome. Either which way, Randy. And my better half is having some pure, 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 pure tea. We are fancy. Yeah, I don't have no fancy stuff. I just got this right here. Uh, correction. Correlation, re I didn't get to see that it went off. Correlation research. Problem now is indigenous discovery stop further digs. For, uh, yeah, but they can't stop any digs at that spot. I don't want Latakia cilantro occasionally. My friend is a herbalist and she makes handcrafted teas. The one I'm having tonight is called Full Moon Team because it is a full moon tonight. Really? So she makes her own teas, handcrafts her own teas. Does she, I wonder if she, does she have, I wonder if there's like a, that would be, I, I would like to try a tea. See, that would be, I would like to try some tea. I love tea. I can't make any of my tea, my sweet tea, because it has too much sugar. Uh, funny, they can tell us exactly what's in the center of the earth. Or lose them. Who would have thunk it? Yes. Uh, pure is a type of Chinese fermented tea. Really, really, really good stuff. I believe it, Yornick. I believe it. I haven't had any. Uh, I told somebody uh, a year and a half ago. I, I wanted to try more teas, and they, I, I got some black tea and some green, some uh, not green tea, but some other teas, and I. And, and from English tea, and, and I didn't like it. It sucked. Uh, Jeannie, I, I don't, I, I'm, I'm ignorant on those. That's what I told other people. Like, we don't, we don't have teas here. We don't have, like, English teas and stuff like that. So I just know I like tea. I li like, I love this tea that you buy. I love sweet tea. I just can't drink the sweet tea because that's way, way, way too much sugar. But, you know, I was just looking for another tea, but I'm ignorant on, on, you know, all the types of teas because there's a lot. And some people put honey in it. Some people put, you know, I, I haven't found any that, like, makes me want to, to, to try it again. See, I like black tea. See, I really didn't like the tea that I got. Patrick's had hibiscus tea. Has been safe during recent storms. Bad stuff went past us. But Cliff from my family near him got hail. We had a little bit of hail. Amber did. Tried Earl Grey. That's what it was. Uh, we had a little bit of hail. Amber, uh, when was that hail? Was that last weekend or this weekend? When was the hail? You was driving home. You said you had a little bit. Was that, was that yesterday? No, I think it was last weekend. Was it last week? Amber said she had a little hail at, at where she goes to college, but it stopped, you know, on her way here. Yeah, I don't, yeah, some people don't, Patrick. That's the thing. Like, I haven't found any that I know that I will like. Like, like, but I've only found two. It's hard to find tea here. It's, it's hard to find tea here. No, it was this weekend. It was this weekend. So she had it yesterday. So yesterday, Amber had, when she was leaving, uh, the university, they had some uh, some hail, but none so far here. 
that is. Uh, uh, hibiscus is yummy. I take your word on it. Full moon tea is, is lemon balm, green tea, jasmine rose. That's a lot of stuff. That's a lot. Like, I, I, you know, I don't know. If you do send any, send just enough for one cup. I don't want to waste, I don't want to waste it. anybody's tea. I'm not worthy or worth enough to, I, I just I just would like to try some tea, you know, just enough for a cup, you know, and then if I like it, then I can say, hey, I like this and maybe try to order me some, you know. Vascular black tea with maple syrup. I can't, we don't have that. <laughs> I keep telling, people don't understand where we live. People don't understand like where we live. Like there's a thousand people here in a 30 minute drive. You have to drive 30 minutes just to see a thousand people. And like it's, it, you got mountains that come down and then you got haulers. And the hauler might be 10 miles and the haulers are like this. And you got mountains. And then beside the mountain you might have a creek. And, and, and it's just like this, it rolls like this. So you gotta go out of the hauler to get to the, like the main road. And then you go to the main road and drive another three or four miles and then you, there might be another hauler on the right. So you go up that hauler for 10 miles. And there might be 20 homes in that hauler that's 10 miles. So, you know, one or two homes for every mile. You know, and, and again, the roads are like this. And, you know, it's at the bottom of a mountain because we live in the Appalachian Mountains. Uh, I still hear, but yeah, I don't have, I don't have a, uh, I don't have a nine volt. So I guess you will hear it. I didn't know, Phil, till just now. Till Randy told me, daggone Randy. You're not going to get any uh, full moon tea, Randy. Boris, I had uh, milk in English breakfast. and there, Yeah, see, I tried that Earl Grey that you told me to, Boris, and I didn't really care for it much. Like, I did try it, but it's just not, that wasn't, uh, it wasn't my cup of tea, I guess would be the old saying. Not my cup of tea. Anyway, I got some stuff to show you. I got some stuff to show you. I want to show y'all. Uh, oh, Boris, here. Let me set this to the side. Boris, it is 68 inside and 44% humidity, 70 degrees outside and 50% humidity. It is 60 degrees and 68% in my big humidor, the, the fridge humidor, and 66 66% humidity right now in my Cuban humidor. Here, will you set this over there? Set this over there. Can I have a water? I don't want another tea. Yeah, I got it because I wanted to know the humidity. I wanted one that would do four because I lost my other humidifier or humidity uh, little station. And so uh, when I bought one, I wanted one to do four. And so the four one tells me my two cigars, the outside and the inside. And so that lets me, I, I like, I don't want to run these cigars. Like that's my big thing. I don't want to run these cigars. Y'all know how much cigars cost and, and I appreciate the people that send me cigars. And I, so I'm going to do my best to take as good as care of them as, uh, I'm going to treat them like, you know, my little babies. So, here will you set my, you set my, uh, my tobacco tray over there on the humidor. Yeah, thank you. Hunter, will you go get the uh, wood? Go get the wood. The deep dark hills of Kentucky is where one might leave a blood trail. There's been a lot of blood trails in the hills of Kentucky. That I can promise you. I do, I did have, I do have one video. I know I don't put out no videos because of that. Amber's video still doesn't have 100 views. Huh? Amber's uh, uh, 20th birthday party still is on like at 96 views. 
I always said, it, once once the videos, if y'all want to see videos, make sure they get 100 views. I'll, I'll do another video. I do have a video in mind that I went to, that I took pictures of, and it is of, set it down. Don't set it on there, set it on here. So I got that out. I do have a video of, uh, move that stuff off of there. Now set it down over there. Yeah, now slide it over there. Yeah, I'll scoot this over, slide it over. Don't drop it, especially on your toe. But I do have a video of Daniel Boone. Daniel Boone come through here. He had a salt lick uh, place, uh, salt mines or whatever, if you want to call it. It's just inside of a, it, it's a big salt spot for, where you can get a tons of salt. And it was used by the Indians. And, and I, I was going to do a video on it. Uh, but anyway, Bob says it's 44 degrees here yesterday and 3 p.m. it was 70. Bob, that's the same thing. They're giving frost tonight. It was 42 degrees or something. They're giving frost tonight here. And then as you see, it's 70 right now. A lot of wild herbs, etc. you can make into tea. Need sweetness, use stevia. Uh, yeah, I, I've used, I've drunk like a, a when I've been hunting, uh, uh, like pine needles, and made like a tea with that. Uh, uh, also, I use uh, ginseng, uh, Steve, for for to make like a little uh, herbal tea uh, with ginseng. No, Zeus. Uh, Thirty-five Fahrenheit, seventy-seven percent, seventy-seven percent humidity. We should get to fifty-five on the afternoon. And speaking of drink, my coffee like uh, strong but sweet and don't care about color. Strong but sweet. Uh, and what was I going to show Jack? I had something to show Jack if he was still here. I had something to, for Jack to see. And I forget now what it was. In the mid 50 now, was high in the 60s earlier. Yeah, that's, yeah. I draw the line at uh, seasick green, Yornick. Night, Jack. Good night, Jack. See you later. <laughs> Daniel Line Root Tease. You see that right there? Are you writing these down? Dandelion. No, I'm not writing them down. You're not writing these down? No. Okay, she ain't been writing none of y'all's suggestions down. You didn't tell me So that we are anything. screwed. <laughs> about me me trying new teas. All I wrote down was so the if 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 you want days. something wrote down, that if you want it, you have to say, Kim, write this down. That's right. Let's just go. Let's just let's just make that happen. If you want me to try something, I don't care a bit to try it. If I can order it off Amazon, I order it off as Amazon. Uh, if you want to send a sample, I don't care a bit to give you know if you have my address or give you that. Um, uh, but she hasn't wrote none of what you all said down. I got dandelion hibiscus. That's all I remember. Dan dandelion and hibiscus is what she's got. Well, Jeannie said she's going to take care of me and send me some samples. So uh, send me a sample or two. So you, so nobody else is just Jeannie. That's it. So that's why you didn't write it down, huh? <laughs> nobody else is worth anything. Their suggestion just out. No. Well, Jeannie's it. it. That's it. <laughs> Jeannie is the tea god. That's right. And nobody else. Kim said, that's right. Women stick together. That's right. There you go. Jeannie, it's all God. That's it. Nobody else. <laughs> that's crazy. That's crazy. Dandelion tea is delicious. I'll try it. Look, I'll, I don't care a bit to try one cup of anything. 77 here in the beach of South Carolina. Uh, uh, we got you, Jeannie I'll said. Go I'm all I back. got a, all right, Everett. You have a good night, sir. Much love to you. All right, I want to show, I'll show you, I want to show y'all something. Dandelion green teas, tea and wine. Yeah, see, we're not really, like, I like a very few wines, and Kim don't really like, like, we have tried, we have, trust me, we have probably tried 50 different wines. And there's been only one, and we can't, we didn't get the name of it. 
that Kim, you kind of liked that one, didn't you? Yeah, it was the only one that had good taste. It was the only one that had good taste. Uh, but now, we don't live next to a winery or nothing like that. Like, you know, we don't live next to that. She hates grape. So, you know. But anyway, I got something to show y'all. Anyway, I got something to show you. I'll show you my next project. I'll show you my next project. Jack. Yeah, Jack left. See? Jack asked me about... Um, the lady, yeah, the lady, yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm not going to argue with Kim about tea. I mean, like, you know, if, if she, if she writes it down and gets it, you know, like, I I'll try. I went back, I'm writing everybody's down, buddy. She went back, she's writing everybody's down, so don't worry. We got you tea. Anyway, Jack ain't here. Jack asked me about the process, a little bit about the process. Um. So anyway, I'll show you all what I got. I'll show you all what I got right from the beginning. Okay, this is the beginning of my project. This project might take me a couple of weeks because, you know, it's a lot of work. It takes a lot of work. Uh, it, it, you know, it might take me a week. I don't know. I, it's according to how I feel. But anyway, I wanted to show you all the start of the project. And Jack asked me... Uh, Two weeks ago on his live, well, well, I wish you'd do a video, he said, on, you know, how you do your epoxy stuff. Uh, well, this right here uh, could be epoxy. It might not be epoxy. I don't know. Anyway, let me turn my camera around, and I'll show you the thing. I'll show you my project. So here's my project. You see, that's Max's tail, by the way. That's the dogs I wear with Amber. And there, there are you all. Y'all ain't said nothing. So anyway, here's the project. So what is that? That's a tree. Piece of a tree cut off with a chainsaw. You can see it's still got the bark on it. It's still live edge. Right there, you can see it's still, it's still live edge. 100% live edge. Let me set it down on this side. I'll flip it over for you. So there it is. 100% live edge. I'll turn you around just because I know the... That's a, that's a walnut, by the way. That's walnut. That is walnut. That is not cedar. That is walnut. I don't even know what ramp line is. But anyway, there's a piece of walnut. Now, what am I going to do with that walnut? It's, I have to, to start off, I have to get rid of all the bark. I will get rid of all the bark, and then I will take a sander, and I will sand, uh, I will sand, cut them, if you cut it down, uh, field to cut it about, uh, cut them about two to three inches thick. Cut your pieces about three inches thick. These go for about uh, $100 a piece. About a three inch thick. You can sell them for $100 a piece. So anyway, we'll make for a good end table. Well, I'll tell you my, I was going to tell you what I'm going to do with it. I'm going to take all the uh, bark off of it, sand off, sand the sides. And then I'll have to uh, take my router Flatten it out, make it make sure it's perfectly flat. Um, and then what I'm going to do, I'm going to put some legs on it, and I'm going to make a stool. I'm going to use a four-leg stool instead of three legs. But I'm going to use those metal legs that I've been using on the tables. I'm going to use those same metal legs, so I'll just one put one like, you know, here, 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 and here, and kind of do it like I will have to get the diameter of this and then... I'll spread them out so, you know, every five inches or whatever, you know, I will put one. And that way they're even all the way around. And uh, I will have four. And I'll come almost to the end, but I'll put them like right here. I won't go all the way to the end. I'll put them, you know, about right there. But anyway, I'll do, uh, I'll do four legs, and I'm going to make this my stool. I'm going to make it a stool about 26 inches or 24 inches tall 
I'll, I'll make this one 24 inches tall. Plus with the three inches of wood, uh, you know, it'll be like 27 inches, but the legs, I'm going to get 24 inches. Uh, what is it? What is it? What are you laughing at? Never heard of it. That would make beautiful clock, live edge, uh, clear epoxy. Yeah, I don't want to make a clock, though. Not that big. That's heavy. That's pretty heavy. TPI like that is, that thing right there is heavy, heavy. I don't know how much it weighs, probably 20 pounds. Uh, don't believe him, he's making an altar. Oh, for my, my sacrifice. That's what you're laughing at. Okay. He's making an altar. So that's interesting. So anyway, that's what I got right there for that. That's my next home project. And I will make that. Uh, I will make that uh, for for Amber w once I die. It, I'm making it for me, but it will go to Amber. And I've told y'all before, when I make stuff on my on my wheel, my wheel gets updated, uh, and it goes to. Uh, like, you know, the wheel's there, but I just write down stuff that I make, and it's already separated, and it's all rolled out. Black walnut, yes. The hairpin legs. Those hairpin legs that I get for those tables, they are solid uh, metal. Instead, of, you, can, you can get some of those hairpin legs are hollow on the inside. The ones I get are... Genie, they are, uh, they're solid. Uh, that's what I, 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 I tell everybody. I can understand why people sell those, sell, sell like those tables for, you know, 250 up to, uh, you know, $450 because uh, the legs alone are $100, you know. Uh, the pieces of wood, if you bought the wood, you're looking at spending probably $100. And then by the time you have, you know, you put epoxy in and stuff like that in those tables, I understand. I understand why people, you know, I mean, even we were talking about that, what's that guy's name, Black Black Blacktail Studio? You know, he sells them for sixty and ninety thousand dollars, but they're, you know, eight foot tables that he's making. You know, but I, I just I was wanting to make a stool, uh, a stool so I can sit down a, a nice stool. And so uh, I think it'll be I think it'll be a beautiful. I could cut it in half, but it is 20 inches, and I think it's a big enough stool without even having to cut it. So that's what I mean. I thought about making a a stool and cutting it, and then putting like a river table stool. But the stool is 20 inches. There's really no need to. Most stools are anyway are like 16 inches around. And that one's 20 inches, so there's not really a need to to put uh, epoxy. And then I will probably use uh, Rubio Monocoat instead of uh, epoxy for the top and the bottom. Friend said everything in his machine shop would go to my landlord when time came. Landlord said, I hope he has a long life. <laughs> so he didn't want none of that. He didn't want it. I try to have everything set up, Phil. That way there's, I, uh, y'all know, I told y'all I've been in 46. I've been with 46 uh, Paul Bears. So. All right, we're down to 14 people, so it's time to wrap it up. Hey, Tim, I do have one more thing to show y'all. Down to 13 people now. Randy, are you and Jeannie still here? Everything does weigh a lot in a machine shop. You're right. You are 100% right. Look at that. Randy said, yep. How come you didn't say nothing a while ago about the full moon tea, Randy? Randy just sat there and just, Jeannie was like, shut your mouth, boy. Shut up. Randy just sat there. He didn't say nothing. Jeannie talked the whole time. Kim was like, yeah, that's the tea I'm getting. And then and there was nothing else was said. Jeannie, 
genie in a bottle. I got a four-inch hole here, Bob. Do I want to read the rest of that? I got a four-inch thick slice of white pine that is four feet in diameter. I bet that's pretty, Bob. Randy says I was busy. I'm glad. Wrap it up. Yeah, there's nobody else on. There's only 12, Jeff. There's only 12. Going to be a beautiful stool, James. I hope so, picking Papa Man. I do my best to make beautiful furniture. I, I've, I've been doing it since I was young. You know, uh, everybody knows that Hunter started making furniture at 13. I mean, you all seen his, you know, his, uh, uh, his table. So he can, he can honestly say that he started making furniture at 13 and, and woodworking and stuff like that. If that's something he likes, uh, uh, then he can do that. I'm just Chris's online now, by the way. Okay. Thank you very much, Ornick. I appreciate that. Thank you very much, TV, TPI. I try to do the good as work as I can, but sometimes, you know, like the epoxy and stuff, you can't. Like, it, you won't, it won't let you. We've talked about that before. <laughs> it gets too hot. That would be a heck of a table, Bob. It would be a heck of a table. 12 is more than I have on my life. Comfortable. Yeah, but Simon usually has 30s. 40s, but yeah, I'm not. Do y'all want to look at pops? Is anybody interested in buying a pop? Look, I'll sell pops. This is Simon's life. I'll sell pops. Simon sells pops. I'll sell pops. Y'all want a pop? I got a pop. Let me show Jeannie and Randy what I have to show them that I've been working on for, I don't know, about a month now. So anyway, I want to show you, Jeannie. Move this back over there. I want to show Jeannie and Randy what I've been working on. For a month, I, I know that they they they're probably wanting to see it. You want me to show it to you? Oh, I'll show I'll show it to you, Randy. Let me get up. I'll show it to you. Ready, ready, Randy? Just a little lower, Randy. Just a little lower, a little lower. No, not that way, Randy. We're going the other way, Randy. No, no, no. Quit thinking dirty, Randy. You dirty-minded thing, you. I went on uh, Roberts other day, and that's all they was talking on. They're just talking about sex. Let's talk about sex, baby. Let's talk about you and me. Let's talk about all the good things and the bad things. Maybe let's talk about sex. Let's talk about sex. No, no, no. We ain't doing that. This ain't Robert's live. Robert, I went on Robert's the other day. That's all Robert was talking about. So we ain't doing that. Anyway, I got you something. Randy, are you ready? I want to know, are you, are you ready, Randy? Don't make the dogs fight. Yeah, don't make the dogs fight. She said, I can't get the dogs happy. <laughs> are you ready? You and Jeannie ain't said nothing. Yes. Where's Jeannie at? How come she's sitting down now and she ain't said nothing? It's his turn to talk. Oh, it's his turn to talk, Kim said. <laughs> so she's not allowed to talk. Do they only have like one ability to talk? So like... One of them gets the phone, and they can talk at once, and then they got to pass it off. Oh, there's Jeannie. Randy is always ready. Randy's willing and ready. Randy's ready, Randy. Randy don't have to get ready. Randy's always ready. Here we go, Randy. How come nobody names their chicken Randy in the UK? I don't know. I don't know. Names their children, not chicken. Where did I get chicken? How did I read that as chicken? Names their children. I don't know. I always said chicken. I, always, I don't know. To be fair, I thought I did too. Did you really? I thought it said chicken. We have jumped off the rails. No, Patrick, we're right here. Right here. Just hold on to the rail, baby. I got you. Hold on to the rail. Let me glide it. Are you ready? Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Flipping it around. And three, two. Where's my drum roll? There you go. I got to fix my tripod here. Zeus, move, please.
I gotta turn it, I'll turn it over for you. There's the back of it. Back of it's not as pretty as the front. So there you go. So let me turn it around. I gotta pick up my, and I'll take it out. What? Something means horny? Randy means horny in the UK? No wonder. No wonder Randy's always ready. Ran horny Randy! Horny Randy! <laughs> so anyway, let me hold here. I don't know if it's too tight. Let me get it out. I'm getting it out, Randy. Randy, I'm pulling it out for you, baby. I'm gonna pull it out, Randy. Nice and slow. Yeah. Give you some ASMR, Randy. It is tight, Randy. It is tight around it. Around the blade. It is tight. There it is. Now this is my, this is a left-handed sheath. By the way, Randy is left-handed. So I'm going to pull it out and I'll set it there and then I'll fix this. Saturday Stumbo is filling a little Randy. I don't know what she means. I guess Jeannie is. Jeannie's. Let me ask her. Jeannie, are you saying you're a little Randy? Is that what you were saying? No, it should, you shouldn't say a little Randy. You says it's a, a lot Randy. I'm, you, little don't go with that. Don't, you should say a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot. Anyway, Jeannie, stop it. Stop it, Jeannie. I'm trying to show you the knife. Let me go from this side. Maybe the angle a bit better. I can't read what they're saying. I'm looking at this. I don't like whatever uh, James is smoking, says Patrick. Um, Philip says, do I make you randy? Yeah. All right. I, I like a what you call it. Let me flip it back up. I'm, I got my back turned. I can't see what y'all saying. Do I make you horny, Randy? Do I? Yeah, baby. Yeah. Oh. There you go. There's the knife on this side. Now, I grabbed this when I was working on this, Randy. I grabbed it with my left hand. I held it with my left hand the whole time. I didn't put it in my right hand. Because I know you're left-handed, I wanted it to feel comfortable left-handed. So that's the way I held the knife was left-handed. And, and Miss Kathy says they have to go. I understand. But anyway, there it is. There's your knife. Good, sir. 100% done. I hope it is the way that you wanted I appreciate you giving me. I appreciate you giving me uh, uh, a month to do it for a while. Steve and Miss Kathy, y'all take care. I'm gonna sit back down. Yeah, there's only nine. You start talking about stuff, they start leaving. Giveaway time. Actually, I'm not giving away, but if y'all want to pop, I'll do that. I got it from my father, no sheath, but not without a leather sheath. You're very welcome, Randy. I'm glad it's perfect to you, brother. It is a deer skinner. I told him he can skin squirrels, rabbits, deer. You can skin anything you want with it. Old timer fixed blade. Maybe using the uh, deck department. Uh, Waiting wait and see how much uh, shipping is, Randy. See how much shipping is. Like, I trust you, brother. Let her ship it to you first and see how much shipping is before uh, uh, before uh, 
before you send any money. Because I, I know I told you how much the knife was, but I don't know how much shipping is. And I don't I, I, and I tell you why. I shipped one, this is just how crazy shipping is. I shipped one cigar uh, holder to Florida, flat cap piper. I showed you all the receipt. It was nine dollars and like eighty cents or something, or maybe nine sixty eight or it was something like almost ten bucks. I shipped two those two navy ones the other day. I shipped those two navy ones the other day to Steph. Well, I say I Kim, the shipping department Kim. That was six dollars. Tell me how much Kim was was the total price of shipping. I know it was six something. It wasn't seven. I charged seven dollars because it was like six eighty six or something, or six ninety three, or six seventy nine or something like. I, I charged seven dollars for shipping, but it was only like six. So it was two dollars, almost three dollars cheaper to send two to Texas, two cigar holders to Texas, using the same way I shipped everything the same. It was almost three dollars cheaper to send two of them to Texas than was to send one of them to Florida. So I don't know how much shipping is, Randy. I, I don't want to tell you, you know, shipping's $5 and then it'd be $10. I don't want to tell you send $10 and it'd be $5. Like, Steph sent me money and I sent her back $14 because I didn't want to send, I, I'm not keeping that, like that's, that's you all's money. You know, I'm not trying to charge you know, anything over. So that's the reason I tell people, just just wait. I don't do this as a business. This is not my business. This is, this I do for, I do this for, just to help you all. I don't want to do any more knives. I, my hands are done. I, I told you all before, I don't really want to do knives anymore. I don't want to do sheaths no more. Uh, a fighting knife that was made at Portsmouth Naval before he was shipped. That's cool, Bob. That's cool. All right, picking and popping. Thank you very much. I'm getting ready to get off here. I'm going to show a couple of pops. I saw that on his live. Thank you very much, Patrick. Uh, anyway, I got a couple. Uh, if you all know of anybody that wants a, uh, wants a pop, I'll show you pops. This is Simon's live. Uh, reach me the pop. And reach my water, too. I'll show y'all some pops. Y'all want to buy pops? Y'all are ready to buy pops? There's only eight people rich. Kim, can I have my pops? The two pops. I'll show them some pops. I have two pops. One smoked. One unsmoked. I don't know where the other one, there it is, I see it over there in the box. Here you go, I cleaned them up for you. I thought that was it. No. I have to go over here. I don't know what that is. I have to go over here. Here y'all go, I'll flip y'all around. Here y'all go. Got it in a, a regular sock. But anyway, I cleaned it up. Here you go. Balkan Sassini, four dot, family era. Try to let you sit in there. Right here, there's a little, I don't know, let it, let it, right here, there's a little tea chatter. I bought this off of eBay years ago. I've been using a, uh, it don't go through or anything like that. It's just, just a little, I'm just trying to point it out to you. You can see it don't go through. It's just a little spot right there. But anyway, uh. I put a uh, I put one of these things on it. It's what I it's, it's how I was smoking it before, but I haven't smoked this in like two years. 
uh, give me a lot, and I can show the inside. Anyway, two years ago, also, um, I sent this to, uh, I sent this to, um, uh, what's the name of that? Let me flip it around. Open that door up right there. Open that cabinet door. Open that second cabinet door. Yeah. What is the name of that over there? Briarville. Thank you. I sent this to Briarville. Uh, I sent this to Briarville two years ago. I sent this to Briarville two years ago. Let me see if I can get the light right before. I don't know how to put the light in here for you so y'all can see. There, you can see he, he just, I had him clean it up and everything. That's what I'm saying about cleaning it up. That was two years ago. There you see the hole. I'm trying to show you as best I can without. I don't know how to. I don't know how this is going in here. Here. Let me stand on this side. Nope, that ain't good. I don't know the best way to do this. How's the best way to to shine to show these? I can't. Hey, you could see the other day into these if I set it down. So let me try that again. Let me set it down like this. The other day you all could see a little bit. If I did it like this. Oh, there you go. Without even, yeah, it's, so this is blocking it. Let me put it over here. Y'all could see better the other day. There you go. That's blocking that side over there. But you can see he put a pipe. He, he put a, uh, he cleaned it out. And he put some pipe mud in it. I haven't smoking, smoking it since. But it's a family era Sassini four dot. It's my oldest pipe. That I have. So you can see it. It's real good. Nothing nothing I know that's wrong with it. I smoked it. The only thing I know that's wrong with it is two little bitty pieces of chatter. So if anybody's looking for it, it's for sale. Let me know what you give me. It is for sale. It is a... Um, I forget... Uh, uh, Hurlingham, Hurling, I don't know if you can see that. Hurlingham, right there. I don't know if you can see it. There you go, Hurlingham. Made in England. Made in England. Uh, I can't read that. What does that say? Just, I can't read that. I don't have my glasses. My glasses are here, and I can't see it. Hurling or Hurling. H. H. I don't know. I'll try to get it close to you there. There, H. You can see it right there. You can see the H. You can see the H right there. So anyway, there you go. I'll flip you back around. Move, baby, so I can sit down. Dogs are over here chasing after. Uh, I gotta come over here and sit down so I can see you, you comments. I wasn't turn. I was turned opposite of you so you can see the light. But I'm, uh, I'm way over budget this month. I don't know anything about the length height, but there you go. Don't know nothing about it. Uh, I don't even have nothing. I don't even have a stick to stick it down in there. There you go. I'll use my middle finger. That's how far it goes down in there right there. Who wants to know how much you want for 
I don't know, Phil. Tell me how much. I was going to say, you know more about it, Phil. Tell us, Phil, how much. Uh, uh, give me something to measure this on the bow height and stuff. Give me like a, a ruler or something. Give me a ruler or something. Might need to take a craft stick and stick it down in your market and then measure it. Tell me a price, Phil. Tell me what I should be selling it for. Tell me, tell me. You tell me. I'm not a seller, Phil. I don't sell pipes. I've never sold a pipe before. Yeah, here you go. I don't know if this will go in. That's why I said take a craft stick and mark it. Here, this is... Yeah, that's not going to go in. So anyway, here, yeah, let me have that craft stick. Let me have the craft. Right. Here you go, Phil. Let's go behind it right here. Right there, you can see I'm, I'm on the edge right there. Well, if you don't give me a price, brother, then I can't sell it to you. It's just a bow coating. It's not pop mud. He just put a bow coating on it. Right there, you can see how many. What is that? What is that right there? Centimeters. There's centimeters, Phil. You want, you want me to show you in inches? I'll put it in inches, too. It's upside down, though. But anyway, right. There you go. I'll put it right on the bottom. Let me get my thumb back up there again. There. I got it on the bottom again. There's my thumb. There's the bow. bow is almost two, yeah, 1.75 inches uh, is, is how tall it is. I don't know deep. Reach me the thing, reach me the stick. I'll tell you the depth of the, what you call it? Yeah, it's a nice pipe. Oh, it, it smokes good. Here you go, I'm gonna stick it right in the middle. Stick it right in the middle. And then I'll put my finger here I don't know if you can see that, Phil. I got my finger there. It's right in the middle. I got it right in the middle, Phil. So I, got, I don't know if I don't know what you can see, Phil. I hope you can. I'm trying to show it to you that I got my finger here stuck right on the edge. There you go. You can see it that way. So I got it in the middle and I got my fingernail there. So right there, I'm going to leave that here. I'm going to set the pipe here, and I'm going to put this up here on the inches. And right there's how deep it is, Phil. Let me scoot this down. There's how deep the bow is, Phil. I got it on my fingernail right where the pipe was. I don't know if you can see that. Looks like 1.5 Don't get over here, dog. Dogs. Don't pull the dog back over there. So I don't want the dog jumping up here and knocking the pipe in the floor. So there it is. I'll show you in centimeters. Let me flip this around. Uh, flip it around for you. There's the centimeters. I'll try to put it up top up there. There's the centimeters, Phil. How long is the overall length of the pipe? I, I think I saw. I think you asked that too. Uh, we'll do uh, inches. So uh, the inches will be upside down because they're this way. But if I, can you stick this here? Can you can you hold this for me? Can somebody come hold this? Just hold this right here. Just hold that stick right there. Right on the edge. Yeah, don't don't let it move. Yeah, just hold it like that. Let me push against it. No, don't twist, don't twist it on me. Yeah, just hold it like that. And that way I can do it. Inches, we're gonna have to go backwards. So there is the inches of the pipe. And it comes, well. I wish we could do it. I wish I could flip that upside down, that ruler. Uh, it's it's roughly right here. See, and I, I can't, because it's upside down. I c can you all see that? Because I can't. It goes to right here. That would be 18 inches, kind of. So it looks like about six and a quarter yeah. is honestly what I would say it is. Probably six plus. Yeah, it's about six and a quarter. I can do it on up here. Here, but hold that back here, Hunter. Here, let me do it like this. Let's just do it like this, Phil. So that way I can try to see. This is about even. The, there's even. There's even. 
And it's on, what is that on right there? There's even. Well, actually, a little bit shorter. Right there's even. I've got it at the button. I'm, I'm a little short, but it's at the button. But there's centimeters. How many centimeters is it on right there? What is that? What is that? What is that? Is that, the top is that what is that, 15? So 15? Measure from the other end? Yeah, well, I can set it here and do it myself. But you just, it'd be like a crotch shot. Well, he said it's too, uh, too big of a bolt. It'd be like a crotch shot. But anyway, it is. I feel it's about, the pipe length is, yeah, the pipe six and a six. Pipe is six and a quarter. Pipe is six and a quarter. Pipe six and a quarter. Like I can do it for myself. It's just hard to hold it up here and do it. So there you go. Uh, yeah, it's six and a, yeah, it's six point two five. Yep. So that is that is that pipe. And like I said, don't I put a uh, I put the thing on the bit. I haven't done that. So, what's a good price for it, Phil? What's a good price? What should I? Uh, yeah. What what what's what what's a good yeah? What's a good price for them, Phil? A Sassini Ford Op Family Era. It's nothing. It smokes good. Was sent to Briarville. I know. Uh, I think he only charged me like fifteen dollars to clean it up, and uh, just I just want him to look at it and see if there was anything wrong because I got it off of of eBay uh, of uh, about three years ago. I guess I sent it to him about two and a half years ago then because I haven't smoked it in two years. I I've only smoked. I don't even know if I smoked it once I got it back. I might have smoked it once. But anyway, there it is. I got it in the sock. It's in a sock so I don't get it dirty. What's a good price for those? I know what I paid for it off eBay. I just don't know the price of them now because I haven't looked on eBay. It's a Sini four dot. You ready for the next pipe? Next pipe. Next pipe. A Mastro di Paha. Italy. In the box. I thought I'd smoke this one. I thought I'd smoke this one, but I haven't. I cleaned it, and I will show it to you. It's in the, I, 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 I cleaned it up a little bit. Uh, I thought I'd smoked it, but I hadn't. And I'll show it to you. I gotta flip this around. Let's go over here in the light. Move, dog. This, it does have a, a bow coating in it, and I, I cleaned it. I thought I'd smoked it, but I haven't touched it in two years, so I cleaned it. But it's not where I smoked it. It's the bow coating. So I'm going to show it to you. Let me go over here. So I'm going to pick it up here, and I'll put it up here, because you all seem to be able to see it from here. Yeah, I kind of come back here. So anyway, yeah. So I cleaned it up a little bit, and it took some of the bow coating off, as you see. 
See, it took a little bit of the bow coating off, which is fine. It's just going down to a briar. Some people don't like those bow coatings anyway. But as you see, it, it cleaned it up a little bit, took some of the bow coating. But then let me take this off. I got to take you over here and set you back down. Take you to the light, and I'll show you. Look here. I'll take this off. Now, it's not hard to pull out. I'll just take my time. And I don't know if you can see the briar. Give me a, my flashlight back. If I turn you this way, you can see the briar still on it. No, it's not nine mil. Yeah, I'd, I wouldn't sell it for 95. Right there, you can see the briar in it. I don't know if y'all can see the see it best. Yeah, that's that's a lot lower than what I would sell it for. I'd never sell it for ninety five. I wouldn't sell the other one for ninety five, no. But y'all can see the briar. I'll try to turn it this way. Y'all can see the briar in there, I'm pretty sure. You can see it's not smoked. I can't, I can't, I can't show it to you like that. Maybe that light, well here, maybe if I do this, stick it up in there, no, that, that still ain't gonna show it, that just, that makes it, I can't see it. You can see the hole. That's what I gave for it, Phil. 100% what I gave for it. I gave 200 for it. I mean, I'd be willing to sell a little, you know, less than what I get for it, but not not that much, not no 55 to something like that. I mean, I wouldn't be, I'm not taking a $150 hit on it. I don't mind to help anybody out, you know, if somebody wanted it, you know, a friend or something like that, you know, take less. Uh, but, you know. Because the pipe is, uh, uh, I'm putting this in, by the way. I'll let you all watch. That way you all don't think I'm messing with you. I don't, I don't, Jeff, I just seen your comment. I, I, I don't know, Jeff, if, if, like, I'm not a pipe repair person. I don't know if it could be put into a nine millimeter. I don't know. Jeff, if, uh, if you like the pipe, you want it, brother. If you want to send it to Briarville and see if he can convert it, I'll send you the pipe uh, if you want it. Are you talking about the first one or the second one? He's talking about this one, the second one. Just go ahead and send this to Jeff. Just send it to him. I don't want the money, Jeff. That's yours. You want to send it, send it to Briarville? Let me get you an ad. Well, I'll get you a phone. Let me get you a phone number, Jeff. Here. Uh, if tenon is 11 millimeter, uh, I don't have a millimeter thing. I don't have a millimeter thing. I don't have a price on that one either, picking and popping. I don't have a millimeter. Do you have a millimeter? Do you have a, do you, where's my ruler at? What is that? What is that millimeters? What is that millimeters feel? What is that? I mean, not millimeters. What's that in centimeters feel? Let me take this back off. Centimeters divided by 10. 
You want me to measure this width of this right here, right, Phil? Right? The, the, that's what you need measured. Or do you want this, or do you want the hole measured? Yes. Yes, this, that's what I thought. Hold this, do not drop this. Please. Let's go over here. Let's go over here, and I'll try to flip you down. Here, hold my... Hold, hold my glasses, we. Here, Hunter, hold my glasses, please. Let me try to, let me try to measure that for you the best I can. Uh, I know it's not clear, but uh, let me scoot it over to the end. So that is five, six, seven. Uh, seven, seven. I need to. That is, I'll put this on one. Maybe that'll be better. Put that on one. Five, six, seven. I don't know if that's eight centimeter. My eyes are not as. It looks like a seven and a half. I don't think that reaches eight centimeters yet, but it could. My eyes is not perfect on that. But I, I, you know, here, I can do it this way too. Let me stick it this way and we can do it lengthways too. I can try to stick it here down by the one. Let's put it on the one. There it's on the one. Well, let me scoot it back over. There it's on the one, so that almost goes to the two that way. So that almost that goes that goes almost over. What is that? That's on the second notch over here. So that is eight. So it is eight. So it's on eight right there. Because that would be nine, ten. So that's eight, eight centimeters. That's what that is. There you go. I don't care a bit. I don't care a bit to I'll flip your back around. There you go. All right, let me go sit down and bring Pop back over here on me. Oh. Let me put, yeah, get my glasses. They're holding everything here for me. They're holding everything. Yeah, reach me the pop. I mean, put the, put the stem back in. I got. I can't see. Well, I won't look how far I went. I went too far. I got to come back a little bit. That's pretty close. That's pretty close. That's pretty close. Don't y'all think that's pretty close? I think so. I can't see. Anyway, let me put it back in its sock. You need another hoe here. And what do you want for it? And don't say nothing. Uh, I, I'll, uh, uh, I don't know what the recommendation is. It can be done. I don't know what that is. Have to face insert nine millimeter. Uh, cone for filter if walls are thick enough. Uh, I don't know. Uh, oh, no, I was going to get you a thing. I don't know if you want TPI to do it. You can get TPI or whoever. The person I sent it to is Briarville right here, and I'm going to flip you around. Right there. That's who did the other pipe right there. You can take a screenshot. Let me know if you got it. Let me know if you get a screen. Just take a screenshot of it and you can call and ask or whatever. Or you can send it to Phil or TPI or whatever. But let me know. Oh, he can't do it. Okay, so, so TPI can't do it. Right there is a guy. Briarville. 
I know he can do it, and he probably don't charge 20 bucks, 30 bucks. I do know that I have these pipes to send to him, them Savinelli's. They're six millimeter. I'm not going to send this one. I'm not going to send the, uh, the, uh, matches 860 pipe, but I do want to send my other six millimeter pipes because I don't like the way they do. I like, I'd rather have a nine millimeter. Right now, I don't smoke them, and it's going to be years for me not smoking them, and I don't smoke them because they're six mil. I don't like the draw. If they were converted to nine mil, I'd smoke them more. And, I, and that even, that's even with the, you know, the, the 320s. But that one I'm going to keep a 6 mil. I, I'm not touching it because it's not I, – I don't really smoke it that much. But it, it's not really – that's my matches, and that's the one that you sent me, and I, I'm, I'm not I'm not touching it. Like, it's not – I don't I don't care if it's comfortable or not. I'm not going to smoke it. No, but, Sharon, we haven't seen Paul tonight. No, Sharon, I have not seen Paul. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, ma'am. I have not seen Paul. But anyway, I'm going to send those pipes to him. And I think it was like, I, don't, I want to say 15 bucks is what he told me when I called him. He was like, yeah, send it to me. I'm, I don't know if he said 10 or 15 bucks to convert it. Uh, those, uh, I just know he has the tools and he does, that's what he does. And it wasn't high to convert when he told me, but now, that's going from a six millimeter to a nine millimeter. I don't, I mean, but that's the reason I say it. If it's, you know, if it's not, he might charge 25. If I, but it could be the same price. It could be like 15 bucks. Uh, I know why she, I, yeah, he's not increased that much. I just talked to him. It is a quick turnaround, too. Yeah, it was a two week turnaround. It was, it was, he, he, did, he did great. He did great. He did great. I just talked to him about those six millimeters, though, and it was 10 or 15. That wasn't long ago, probably a month ago. Uh, but if he's increased it $5, I'll pay it, or $10, I'll pay it. But I'm going to have, like, five, what is it? No, there's seven or six. How many of those? I don't know. I got six or seven, seven Ellies that I'm sending. So I, I figured, you know, if he does $15, I figured $100, I'm fine with that. Like, I'm fine with that because then I'll smoke them, you know. But the way he was talking, it was like 60 bucks. Uh, uh, that's why I'm smoking corn cobs. They are 6-millimeter filtered. My other pops. Yeah, see, Bob, I don't like a 6-millimeter because it's tight. The draw is so tight. That's what I don't like about six millimeter. The draw is tight. I like a nine millimeter filter pop. I agree with Jeff uh, on that. Uh, I have that pop and I haven't smoked it. He said here for two years, I haven't smoked it. I haven't smoked it. So why not get rid of it to somebody that will smoke it? Yeah, he's, he's real cheap on his. Yeah, I, yeah, that's what I called him for. He's done those pops for me. He did the, that Sassini 4 dot. Uh, stem replacement. What do you mean stem replacement? He didn't replace it. That was just to make the 6 millimeter a 9 millimeter. That's what, the, what I'm talking about. That's not replacing all the stem and everything. Who said stem? Who said, why are you going there? Who said that? Did I say see replace the stem for fifteen dollars? Mm -hmm. Pebbles, get down. Did I say that? Just be watching the pebbles. I don't know what he's I don't just example of pricing now, I know what you meant. So you're just telling me the price of a stem, although we've never, we ain't talked about stem replacement. Is that what you're saying? How do you like it, Bob? You've only got one nine millimeter. How do you like it? Do you not like that? 
Do you not like the, the airflow? Think you get more airflow out of But now some people like tight airflow. Josh loves a tight airflow. That's why when Josh tamps, he tamps real tight. You know? Phil, you confused me, brother. Hand it. Yes, just grabbing. Okay. Thank you, Phil. Yeah, I know we talked about it the other day on somebody else's live about STEM. Uh, uh, oh, Simons. Last weekend, Simons. About doing it. And I know we was talking about him. Uh, he, he charged, I think he said 60. Simon charged 60 to make a new stem and re Simon did, Simon fixed the old stem to be nine millimeter plus made a new stem and charged the guy 60 bucks. Seven alley six minute only needs to get rid of that. Adapter tube in the tenon to be 900%. 100%. I would much rather have, I would much rather have a, uh, a nine millimeter than those six millimeters bores. 100% they need to get rid of. I, I don't, I, I would love it. But now a lot of people must love the six millimeter or they wouldn't be selling like crazy. Like Savinelli's made them for years, you know. Like, you know, they're not going to sit here and say, well, James likes 9 millimeters, so we're going to change our whole system. No, I don't. I like it. So you do like your 9 millimeter, Bob. I only have six pops. Bob, I, there, there, there's nothing wrong with that. Smoke all of them. My grandfather had two pops, but he only had two different tobaccos, and he only smoked one tobacco. Uh, as for, yeah, it's very reasonable, TPI. I thought it was a great price. I thought Simon would say like $100, $125. No, I take that back, TPI. Hold here. Let me say that again. Let me say it again because I'm wrong. So I want to be right. 60 or 65 pounds, which is probably about $125. I said dollars. When I say, when I say Simon, I should always say pounds, but I forget. I'm, you know, I'll, I'll take fault right there. I'll take... I'll be the first to admit I was wrong, right? That's quick. Nobody else has to tell me I'm wrong. I'll tell you I'm wrong. I'm not like some people is just going, I'll fight you. No, 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 I'm not going to do that. He charged He charged him, I think he said 60 or 65 pounds is what he charged the guy. Uh, is what I think he said. And I thought that was still reasonable. I'm looking for a 50 millimeter filter. Yeah, reasonable. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, I thought it was good. About ninety-five dollars. Yeah, that's could be. I don't. I don't have a convert. I don't. I'm not good on that conversion. But I will take your word for it, Phil. I believe you. Filter free for me. Well, that's 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 why I was selling that uh, Sassini four dot. Like I said I'll take a price reduction in it. But I, I'm definitely 100% not selling a, a, a Sassini 4 dot for $55. No, you can go buy a basket pipe brand new for $55. You know what I mean? Um, yeah, he's on a fixed income. I know. I tried to hook Bob up. I sent Bob nine pounds of tobacco. I, hook, I tried to hook him up. I like old Bob. I hooked him. I, I tried to hook him up, man. Bob has to go over to another state to find tobacco. So, uh, because the, his state, he can't get, uh, in Maine, he can't get, like, flavored tobacco and stuff like that. It's harder for him. So, uh, he has to uh, go, and, man, I, I hate to see that. So, I, I Bob's a good dude. So, I, I sent him what I could. If folks knew what goes into restoration or building a pipe for scratch, they would understand why we say that is very, yeah. Yeah, I mean, the pipe I built, I I, I wouldn't take, I wouldn't take, I, I wouldn't know. I, the pipe I built sucks. The pipe I built is not anywhere near. The pipe I built is a point, uh, point one two five.
And the pops, that, you know, Simon and Phil and Jason Mouton and, and, and people that's good are like, you know, if they're tens, mine is a point one two five, and and they probably ain't gonna call themselves tens. Uh, you know, they probably won't even say that about their own pops. I'm just saying their pops are really good, and if their pops are tens, my pop is a point one two five. And no, I would not make my pop for fifty five dollars. Uh, I don't know if I see. I don't know if the pops are. Uh, I, I don't know. I haven't looked at stuff for sale. All I've seen is, uh, all I've seen is, uh, new pops. I don't get on eBay. So I, I don't know if it is soft. So I got, once again, Phil, I got to take your word for it. There you go, Bob. I send you tobacco, and that, look at there, Jeff. Jeff will send. You. Yeah. If you if you tell me, Bob, to to give Jeff your address, I'll give Jeff your address tonight, Bob. I sent you the tobacco. Jeff will send you a, a, a pipe. There you go, Bob. If it, just tell me, and I'll I'll tell I'll tell Jeff your address tonight, brother. I'll give Jeff your address as soon as I get off here. Bob, or is Bob here or is Bob passed out? Did you hit your head, Bob, on the floor? You're going to have to pick up that phone, brother, and chat. I looked while chatting ridiculously soft right now. Yeah, they could be. Probably are. I mean, it don't bother me sitting there. But like, you know, like that pipe right there, if, you know, if Jeff wants it, I, like, well, I'll send, I'm, I'm sending it to Jeff anyway. I mean, he, he, I'll send that whole box. Give him my address, okay? I'll give it to him. As soon as I get off the live, I'll give him the address, Bob. Here, baby. Take that. Send that to Jeff. Oh, that's my mail table. So there, I gave a pop away tonight too, Bob. Me and Jeff both give away a pop. There you go. See there? We're down to, we was down to, no, don't want nothing. Nope. Don't want nothing for the pop. Nope. Money means zero to me. Uh, you know that. Many have talked about that. Money means zero to me. I don't, I, I hate money. Money is the root of all evil. Scared me to death, and it was that cat in that box. <laughs> no, Zeus, leave the cat alone. Scared me to death. I didn't know what that I thought that was a rattlesnake. <laughs> I, I don't know if, if Randy was here. Where's Randy? Randy's already gone. Randy sent his knife. He's gone. He ain't talked. He, he Him and Jeannie ain't talked in 30 minutes. If he was here, though, he would say, what was that? I, did you all hear that? It went... Did y'all hear that? That scared me to death. See the cat in the box? I don't know if y'all can see the cat, but the cat flipped. The cat was, I don't know if it's cleaning itself or something. I'll tell you, Jeff, I'll, I'll tell you, Jeff, I'll, I'll tell you what tobacco he likes. I seen him, I seen him though, a brand new tin and a jar of, of uh, his favorite. So I seen him like, uh, uh, I sent him three a three 3.75 ounce tin and a or 3.125. What do those come in? Three and a half ounce tins? Mm -hmm. I sent him like three and a half ounce tins and I sent him another uh, a jar full. Another like as much as you can get in a jar. Like two, three ounces of, of it. Uh, I, I sent him I sent him his favorite. I sent him two of it <laughs> two 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 of his favorites. Yeah, the McBurn HH Pure Virginia. That's what I sent him. I sent him. I sent him a three, and I sent him a bunch. I sent him nine pounds. I did. I sent him nine pounds. Randy was eating some cake. Yeah, and he was eating some cake. Like I sent him a bunch. Uh, Randy was. 
Oh, Randy was. I did. I thought you was talking. I thought you was talking about Bob. I didn't hear anything. I was in the kitchen getting a piece of lemon cake. Go eat your cake, baby. Um, yes, Randy. Can Jenny send the tea to your pe? Yeah. Yeah. I, yeah, I, uh, I'll send it on, brother. Send it on. I'll give you the address as soon as I get off the live, which I'm, I, I need to. I've been on here two over two hours. Over two hours. Two hours and seven minutes. I wasn't going to stay on here but an hour. But look here. Uh, you spend an hour and 45 minutes, and here we are giving away giving away uh, uh, pops. What's time with your friends? Yeah, I mean, what's time with your friends? There's only nine people. Everybody left. Everybody left, and now's the time, like I said. Here's the time where you got you, you know, the, the, the people that, you know, want to stay with you. And and I, that's that's the people that want to stay with you, the people that are for you uh, at the at the very, that's, that, that, you know, that just, that means so much more to me, you know, because I, 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 ain't, I ain't on here to try to, you know, do anything to mean to anybody. I'm on here to try to make people smile and give to people. Yeah, main outlaw. That's what I already told them. I'm glad you still are picking and popping, brother. I'm glad you're still here. As you see, we try to, you know, quantity, quality over quantity. That's right. That's why I'm, you know, uh, uh, you know, Bob like, hey, Jeff, I know I didn't tell you this, but I'll tell you too. Bob loves cigars. He loves cigars. Bob is a cigar smoker. Bob loves cigars. So I tell you what, Jeff, I'll send him, I didn't send him no cigars. I sent him tobacco. I sent him nine pound tobacco, but I'm going to send him some cigars. So I'll send him some cigars too. And then you, you're going to send him some tobacco and a pipe. So I'll send him some cigars too. And uh, and then I gotta send Jeff. I'll send Jeff. I gotta send Randy stuff, Jeannie stuff. Oh, I got something else here. I'll show you something else I did today. Reach me that over here, Amber, for your friend. Yeah. So I made something else today for Amber's friend. Then I'll show you this. Let me flip this over. Here, let me turn it sideways. Okay, go ahead, baby. You're not, oh, stay right there and I'll put it here. Yeah, but it's getting a glare of the thing. There you go. Let me turn around, baby. Yes, now I'll put it uh, kind of out, yeah, right there. Yeah, like that. So I made this, this is one color blue, kind of turn it like that so they can see it. Yeah, and then rotate it. Yep, just like that. So I made, uh, her roommate, I told y'all I made Amber one, and Amber uses it at nighttime, and Amber puts her rings in here and stuff, uh, like on her fingers and like her cell phone and stuff. And her uh, roommate that she just moved into a couple weeks ago loved it, and so Amber asked her favorite color and said, uh, you know, she'd ask her dad. So that's what I did. So it's one color. It's one color. Here, let me have it. I'm trying to get it, yeah. So it's one color blue for the mountain, and then it's a different color blue for the uh, for the lake. I don't know if y'all can see that. So it's two different colors, blue and then white for the white cap mountains. And then she's going to use it for the, uh, she's going to use it for, here you go. She's going to use it for, uh, she's going to use it to put like, uh, rings and uh, whatever she wants to put in it at night time. Uh, I missed what he said, nice mark. So TPI must said something I didn't see. Mine is so empty though, I gave mine away. Don't smoke cigars. Enough. I don't know, I, I don't know if Mark is here. If, there's mine, there's my humidor. It holds I don't, I don't, what does it hold? I don't know. I have to ask Jeff. 
What is it hold, Jeff? What does it hold, Jeff? What does it hold? 300, is that right? Is that what it is? Is it 300 or 400? What is it, Jeff? Somebody asked, oh, I don't know why I flips you around. I don't know why I flips you around. Uh, I have smoked cigars for 30 years. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like mine also, Boris. Uh, reprint my humidor is as empty as the last bomb. A few of those you're giving. I'll take a few of those. TPI, if you want some cigars, a uh, 300, yeah. Yeah, it's not the 150. It's the bigger one. The other one is 150, right? Or are they 175? And then this one's a 300, yeah. Uh, TPI, if, if you need... Uh, do, do I have, we have Mark's address. Yeah, I think so. TPI, I don't care a bit to send I you some cigars. You can email it. Uh, yeah, Bob's got an eyes. I, I can show Jeff your humidor, Bob, if you want me to. Yeah, TPI, I'll send you some cigars, brother. Email after we go to the dentist. Uh, yeah, now look. Look here. I don't even know if I'm going to be... Uh, I'll, I'll be here Tuesday. I don't know if I'll be... Uh, uh, on we're talking to Josh on Monday. I have a dentist appointment Monday. Uh, I haven't been to the dentist in a while, so I don't know if I have any cavities or anything. Uh, hopefully I don't. So Kim just said after we go to the dentist, she would send it out Monday. Yeah, either on my way up to... Uh, up I'll show him, Bob. I, I, yeah, I'll show him, Bob. I don't care a bit to show Jeff. Jeff... Me and Jeff talk. Jeff is a great dude. That's why I don't, you see, I don't, when he says, I will do anything I can for Jeff. Jeff is a wonderful, wonderful dude. Uh, Sayed is a wonderful, wonderful dude. Uh, you know, and, and I'm, uh, uh, like, uh, uh, every one of you are wonderful, wonderful guys. I'm just saying those two guys will, has just went above and beyond like anything I could ever imagine. Like, the, uh, you know, how do you brag on two people and not brag on other people, though? You know, like other people has been really, really good to me, too, you know. Uh, I'm just saying, they're really good dudes. That's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> There's a, he's just... He said he'd trade. I'll t I'd take that rooster. Trust me, I'd take that rooster in a heartbeat. But yeah, I love Jeff to death. I love Jeff to death. Uh, you know, and and that's the reason I showed you all the stuff that I ordered. I ordered tobacco just for you all and cigars just for y'all to try to uh, to try to. Uh, James, you can send him my cell number. Bob, I can do that, Bob. I don't care a bit. I'll give him all the information uh, to do that. Does he? Have, yes. 100% breathing. What? I said, why did he send us money? Why did who send us money? Uh, TPI. Who sent us money? Mark. When? Just now. TPI sent us money? Well, I'm pretty sure. I mean, I'm looking. Why did he send us money? Oh, right there, he's telling you. Okay. That was to help with what giveaways? Oh, you're talking about the tobacco? Right now, the to you talking about the tobacco next week? Or the tonight, the pipe. Or the pipe tonight. What are you talking about? Well, I say next week. I don't know. I Or I say next week, Tuesday, I mean. I haven't got the tobacco yet. I ordered from Chippin' Pops. Usually gets here in three days. If it's here by Tuesday, then then I'll I'll give it away. I, you know, I ordered it for everybody. I to figure out how much I Boris, also, I got to send to you, too. Boris, if there's anything you want, tell me right now because Kim has your shirt done. Kim has your shirt done. We are ready to send out the shirt. So I can send out the shirt. Is there anything else you want? 
because I would have to order it and stuff like that if there's anything you want. Because I'm, 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 I, I'm, I'm going to send a shirt. So if there's something you want me to try to get, tell me right now. No, I'll, uh, Kim, I, she gets the, she can get money, she gets the money off and gives it to Amber, but if you tell her it's for just the shipping on it, then she can get it out and use it for shipping, I guess. Uh, but usually she uses the, what you call it for, for Amber only. Uh, but, uh, Boris, is there anything you want? It's even here. Please tell me if there's something you want before I ship this shirt to uh, Finland. A couple of days, Boris, I'm telling you to send, I'm sending it out now, Boris. Monday morning. What do you mean a couple of days, Boris? You're going to have a list longer. I'm just aggravating you, Boris. You can holler at me in a couple of days. That's fine, brother. Just let me know if there's something that you, you know. Just the, send us 30. If there's something that you want, uh, you know, me to ship to you. Because I know shipping to you is like 25 bucks, so, you know. And that's no matter what I send. If you want a cigar holder, Boris, you have to let me know. Uh, you know, let me know, let me know, you know, if there's a favorite uh, uh, soccer uh, team. Zeus is underneath your, your seat. If there's a favorite soccer team that you want me to do for you, Boris. Let me know, and I, I don't care a bit to make you a, uh, you a cigar uh, what you call it, a cigar holder, you know, with your favorite soccer team or something. You know. Uh, I just said with the picture of Zeus. Uh, yeah, or I, Kim said, Kim said, forget your favorite soccer team. She's going to take a picture of Zeus and put a <laughs> cigar holder and put Zeus's, when he's his Zeus's eyes. face in it. In it. Yeah, I don't know what the X. That is that's your stem stuff. That's what that is, right? Picking and pipe, I only charge fifteen dollars plus shipping because if I didn't charge the shipping, I w it would be free. Uh, like I said, I sent one to Florida, one one tobacco holder to Florida was ten dollars. So if I didn't charge shipping, I'd be I'd make five dollars. And I'm not making five dollars on it anyway because it costs more than the you know uh, with the uh, the epoxy and stuff like that. And then I have to we print off the what you call it. Mustache wax. But yeah, fifteen dollars plus shipping and handling. Like I said, I sent two of them to Texas to Steph and Skip, and they were six. Six. It'd be, it'd be about five. It, it was like six sixty. Yeah, I want to say five six dollars, but like I said, I sent one to Flat Cap Piper, and it was nine something. One, and two of them to Steph and Skip was six something. I don't. It made no sense to me. I was made say, no I sense said, to I said me. That, but I don't know where uh, he lives. Shipping, there goes the beer, but my dad was in the Navy. Cool, I don't care a bit to make another Navy one pick and pop him. Like I said, all the money of that don't go to me. All the money of that I make for any of that, if you send any money to Kim through any of that stuff, all that money goes to Amber on the, on the, uh, on the, uh, What's that called again? PayPal. Now, if you put for shipping, then I, Kim can use it for shipping. I don't have nothing to do with shipping. I don't ship. That's called Kim. So she can either take it out of, well, she makes money too, but I, I was going to say my account, which is my account. It's her account. We have one account. She can take it out and use it and give the rest of the money to Amber. I don't care. Just transfer it to a checking account. Uh, but, uh, you know, uh, uh, Thank you, 
She said, thank you, Phil. I don't know what, what that means. Yeah, he could have said. <laughs> oh. It probably may have showed up in line before it did the big screen. Yeah, Amber, Amber is a, here, I'll show you my daughter. There she is. Hi. With her dog. You see where her dog, you see why I say her dog, because that is her, like, he goes, he follows her around, he sits beside her, it, it's, he goes to her room like, he, he, that's her dog. Phil said hi, Amber. That's her dog, 100%. But my daughter is uh, one semester. She has how many more weeks of this semester? Three or four? Four. She has four weeks left of this semester. She goes next semester, which we end like December. The uh, She's off for the summer. She's working the summer. Uh, she works the summer. So she'll work at the, what you call it, but anyway... She'll have uh, three college degrees, and and that is a uh, 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 you know three college degrees in two years. So she has three college. She'll have three college degrees in two years, and then she's going to be a far a pharmacist. Yeah, like she's the smartest person I know. Like I. I I don't like. Yeah, she's real smart. Gonna... Gotta go, buddy. All right, Phil. Yeah, I'm leaving too, brother. I'm leaving too. Like we've been on here for two and a half hours, and I didn't even, <laughs> I didn't even try to, like I I, I told y'all at the beginning an hour. Thank I'm you. just on here talking to you all, just like we're just talking. This is like I'm, I tell everybody. This, Tuesdays nights for me is that's why I call it family gathering because it. It honestly is. It reminds me of my family coming around on Sundays and everybody just getting together and just talking. Are you wanting this list or you're not going to do that tonight? Uh, he don't do the list. You want me to name it off? No. I'll name it. If you've kept it all night, I'll name it. Give it to me before everybody leaves. Thank you, TPI, in case he didn't hear me. Did, uh, did he? She said thank you, TPI. Anyway, thank you, Josh. Hope you had a good dinner with your family. Uh, thank you, Abe. Thank you, uh, Badger. Thank you, Boris. Thank you, Chip. Thank you, uh, Everett. Thank you, Robert. Thank you, Gamecock. Thank you, Glum Chum. Thank you, Edwin. Thank you, uh, Bob. Thank you, uh, Jack Ryan. Thank you, JD. Thank you, uh, Todd. Thank you, Nathan. Thank you, Patrick Grant. Thank you, Phil Rivera. Thank you, Sid. Thank you, Picking and Popping. Uh, thank you, Sharon. And I hope... I hope uh, Sharon doesn't know where Paul is, and that kind of worries me. Paul, I know you wasn't here tonight, brother, but I, I, I hope everything's all right with you, brother. That, you know, if Sharon don't know where you are, then that worries me. And, and uh, that, that kind of bothers me and it worries me. So I hope and I pray, brother, that everything's all right with you, Paul. Uh, thank you, uh, Tony. Thank you, Randy. Thank you, Jeannie. Thank you, Steph. Thank you, Skip. Thank you, Stephen, Miss Kathy. Uh, Stephen, uh, thank you, TPI. Mark, thank you. Thank you, uh, Welsh was here. I didn't, did I say hi to Welsh? I don't know if I told him hi or not. I don't know. Thank you, Jeff. Thank you, Yornick. Thank you, Zippo. Um, I have, I hope I have everything wrote down, the T's. She's got T's up here wrote down, see? See here, she has T's. And then look here, she has the cutters wrote down. She has cutters, cause I, I could, I need the cutter, cause all mines are, they go. So she has Cuban Crafters and Col Colibri. So she has those wrote down, so see? Okay, Phil sent you something on her Instagram and everybody's saying happy Easter, so. Yes, uh, by the way, yeah, happy Easter to everybody. God bless you. Uh, happy, uh, 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 they have Passover. I, I don't even know if it's polite to say happy Passover. I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't, if it, it's not polite, I'm sorry. I'm just trying to wish you good. Happy Passover. Happy Ramadan. Happy, I, ha happy 
holiday. Happy, is it a happy holiday? You know. Uh, ever have a celebration. Ever have you, yeah, ever, ever. And if you're not celebrating, I hope you have a happy day anyway. I really do. You know, if you don't celebrate anything, you ain't got no religion, I hope you, I hope you have a, a heck of a great day tomorrow and today and this weekend and a great week. I hope to see you Tuesday on the live. No, thank you all. Thank you all. Thank you all. Uh, thank you all. It's, it's, uh, I, I'm nothing. This, you all are the, the great things that I love coming and I appreciate coming. I really do. Thank you all so much. And I'll get you all stuff in the mail. And hopefully, uh, Hopefully we can do some giveaways Tuesday. I hope uh, that stuff gets here from Smoking Pops and we can do some giveaways. Uh, I hope that I make it past Monday and my mouth's not <laughs> too terrible or horrible uh, and go to the doctor. But uh, anyway, uh, God bless you all. Thank you all so much. There, right, I'll give you a kiss. Thank you all very much. God bless you. Much love to you. Y'all have a wonderful week. See you. Bye-bye.